The funny thing about moms and dads who are expecting, especially for the first time, is that they don't know what to expect. So we've invited women who just delivered a baby at Swedish to talk with moms about to deliver a baby at Swedish. They're meeting at the perfect place for families going through the wonder of becoming parents at the new Lytle Center for Pregnancy and Newborns at Swedish First Hill. The Lytle Center's two things. Number one, it's a clinic where moms and babies are gonna come soon after childbirth to make sure they're doing okay. And second of all, it's a resource center, an educational center, a retail center, so that we can address the needs that parents are going to have before childbirth and afterwards. We have the Charles and Lisa Simone living room here. I'm very proud of this space because it's a place where people can come and talk and rest and feel comfortable. It doesn't feel like a hospital at all, and that's what I like best about it. So many of the questions that expectant moms and dads have can be answered at the Lytle Center. For those of you that are breastfeeding or have breastfed, did you have any troubles with that or did it come naturally? For me, it came pretty naturally. The first two weeks were a little tough. I'd say it's been a process and right away, right after she was born, she latched on and I was like, yay, hooray. And I thought the pain was just part of what was to be. And then with the help of lactation consultants in the hospital, um, we were told, no, it shouldn't be hurting that hard. We had a consultation here at the Lytle Center yesterday, and it was an amazing, amazing consultation. It completely, just overnight, changed the way that we are uh, breastfeeding now, and we both got a good night's sleep last night. Uh, Julia is, is, you know, very well fed now, and it just really made a huge difference. To support all of our moms who are breastfeeding, and especially for those moms who are having problems, we have breastfeeding experts that you can see here in the Lytle Center, whether you deliver at Swedish or you deliver someplace else. We're also really proud of our retail area. It's a beautiful space. It offers lovely gifts, but also it offers all those things that moms really need to have. And as a grandmother, I was sent all over the city trying to buy these things. And I am so happy now that we have one-stop shopping for the really important things you need for pregnancy, also for some of the frills. So this question's a little bit more personal. I was just wondering if any of you have experienced postpartum depression or know anybody that has and how you dealt with that. I definitely had something, but it took, like I was saying, all those people asking how you're doing and you put on that happy face, mm -hmm. like I'm so happy about my baby, but right. I was a little crazy. I didn't know what end was up at that moment. So one of the things that's great here about the Lytle Center is they have help for you and um, all the information you need to help you get through that and help steer you in the right direction. Postpartum depression is not something that people want to talk about. You're supposed to have a baby, you're supposed to be happy. Research shows that if you don't treat postpartum depression, it has huge ramifications for not only the mom, the entire family, and really the baby. And so we are very excited about this extensive program we're developing for offering services to the whole community who are gonna help moms with this problem. One of my favorite parts about this whole place is the playground. There is no place else on this whole campus where you can let a little kid run around and we have a beautiful playground here. We have an outdoor area where adults can sit, have a cup of coffee, be comfortable, be outside, which again is very important when you're stuck inside a hospital all the time to have a little bit of fresh air. One of the things that's really fun in the Lytle Center is we have a baby changing station. Now that might not sound very fun, but as soon as a baby comes on that and is getting its diapers changed, there are everyone in the Lytle Center starts ooing and Googling over this baby. We have that right here. Anybody can walk in, change their baby, weigh the baby, and believe me, they're gonna have a big audience when they do that. The Lytle Center isn't just for families having their babies at First Hill. It's for all the families in the Swedish system, but it's also for any family in the area who would like to have our services. I have heard that you don't ever really know how much you can love a person until you've had a baby. Is that what your experience has been? Oh. oh <laughs> There's nothing you wouldn't do. You know, it is really like being so far gone in love. There's just nothing you wouldn't do for the cause. I think when they say you've never felt love like that before, it's a different kind of yeah. love. You would do anything and give her anything. Yeah. Yeah. yeah.
Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's so overwhelming that I can't answer that. You just, yeah, you would do anything for your kid and The reason I really, really am proud of having the Lytle Center here is because it offers a little extra to parents. This is a hospital, and yet at this place, we can offer the extras that maybe a hospital doesn't necessarily have. I'm very, very proud that we could offer this softer side, the lovely side, and that we could combine it with our complex medical care. We think we have things to offer you, and we'd love to see you here.